Hello and welcome to another Final Cut Pro 10 tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to be taking a look at uh, filling audio channels and converting stereo tracks to mono tracks, which is actually really straightforward. So if we take a look, we've got an audio stream here inside of a multicam clip. But this audio stream was recorded via the auxiliary cable plugged straight into a Zoom H1, which is just a basic audio recorder. But it was only recording um, one mono track, but the zoom records in stereo, so we have sound coming out of the left speaker, but not the right speaker. How do we convert this to a mono track? And it's actually really straightforward. So make sure you've got your clip selected, then go into the inspector panel by clicking on the inspector here, and then go into audio. Make sure you click on audio, and you can see we've got some basic options on sound. We can actually just click on here where it says stereo we can reverse stereo which will basically swap the channels over or we can click on dual mono now what that does is that it takes each of the stereo channels because the way stereo works is you have a left um, waveform and a right waveform and then you get different stuff coming out of different speakers so if we take them two tracks we've got nothing coming out of one speaker and something coming out of the left speaker if we click on dual mono that means that nothing is gonna come out of both speakers but at the same time the left which has all the sound in it is going to come out of both speakers as well so we now have our singular um, stereo track with a missing audio uh, channel coming out of both speakers which has effectively solved our problem um, you can see there's no waveform on the second channel so what we can even do is uncheck it so we can say don't play this channel because there's nothing there um, and that will even speed up the rendering time if you're adding audio effects because it doesn't have to do any calculations for the second channel. Uh, and that is effectively it. So hopefully this was useful um, and there will be some more tutorials coming out next week. I've been extremely busy uh, but there's going to be a good, good number this, um, this week coming and next week. So stay tuned and I've got some great stuff coming soon.